future of the home of the Chiefs is uncertain. The state of the home of one of Arrowhead's main builders is concrete. As KNBC 9's Donna Pittman shows us, all you have to do is cross State Line Road and look for the dome. The house that Bob built in 1967, still standing, standing out. His handprints in the blueprints, and his heart is all over. Oh yeah, it's easy to be proud of him. When Mark Campbell's parents moved to Overland Park from Texas, you could take the couple out of the valley, but... They wanted to have a Rio Grande Valley in Overland Park. Bob, an engineer, did designing and building this dome home. Being able to enclose the most volume, have the most South Texas here, with the least amount of material was was a really good thing and enduring the cabinets are original the we did replace the um ca the countertop it was like a tile that was falling off bob's granddaughter kelly and her husband got married here live here it's really nice to see storms um, out the windows and be able to have so much light coming in they're raising their kids here we watch tv in here and uh you know when we have friends over sometimes sitting here we uh, use this room quite a bit. Among quite a bit of memories, Kelly was at Grandma and Papa's all the time. I think I knew as a child that it was very different than other people's houses. I don't think I knew until I was an adult quite how unique it was or how special. Special and especially expensive to maintain. There's a lot of work that needs to be done and none of it is standard. So much here from knobs to linoleum to the bathroom sink is original. Being here is in some ways being back in time, but take in the indoor orange tree, the giant rubber tree, the patio that tells time with the sun. Its shadow at noontime will point to this north-south strip. It's also being somewhere surreal. We have plants in our house and we have a pool basically in our living room. You know, there's a lot of, and we have like a heated like outdoor space during the winter. It's heated by the sun. Yeah. Um, so there are a lot of really beautiful things about this house that make the work worth it. To help with costs, the Campbells rent their home for short events and shoots. It's really fun to see how people use the space creatively and how they use it differently. Just try and make these kids as happy as I was. In this Nike spot, number 87, sitting right where Lolly did her ironing. My grandma loved football, so I think she'd be very excited yeah. about um, a football player being here. Also fitting since her grandpa was the Bob of Bob D. Campbell and Company, structural engineers behind Arrowhead and Kauffman Stadiums. You know, they've had a good life. I think both stadiums are still very good stadiums. More points of pride for this family, so deeply rooted in memories in the metro under the dome. Donna Pittman, KNBC 9 News. Oh, that is so interesting. Donna did a great job. The Campbell Dome House is on the Kansas and National Registers of Historic Places. And if you're interested in learning more about renting the house, you can find it on Peerspace.